Hey guys, it's Izzy and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another weekly vlog, which happens to be my birthday weekly vlog. Now, if you are anything like me, I drag my birthday out for weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks. So, I have stuff planned all this week in preparation. My birthday is actually tomorrow, it's the 29th of June. Today is sort of getting my life together, ready for my birthday. I have an interview in about an hour with the BBC. It's for, I'm not sure if I'm allowed to stay, but it's basically they want to speak to me for perspective on living with a disability. I just thought I'd start this vlog now, but I'm currently just editing last week's weekly vlog it was a bit of a short one but yeah i'm just editing that um whilst watching or listening to Grey's anatomy i hope you do enjoy this vlog um and i hope it's fun getting to see my birthday i'm also going to film some birthday content this week i'm going to actually film on what i got for my birthday because they're always so requested so i'm going to do that as well this week so i hope you guys enjoyed this video okay guys i thought i'd just update you really quickly i have done everything i needed to do today in preparation for my birthday so i am now going to go to the gym um because I can. <laughs> so I will see you guys in the video tomorrow on my birthday when I'm finally 18. Hey guys, so I thought I would update the vlog as it is now my birthday. It's just gone 11 o'clock and my nan and granddad are actually coming around in a little bit because we're going out for lunch. I opened some of my presents this morning which is really nice. I'll actually show you downstairs because my parents actually decorated the living room. It's really pretty and also my cake is absolutely stunning. So I'll be sure to show you all of them in a minute. But yeah, I just thought I would show you. This is my outfit for the day. I just wanted something that was quite cute and cosy. And then obviously I'm getting changed later because I'm going out, out with my friends. So I'm just getting my stuff ready to sit downstairs for going out for lunch. Um, so I've got everything for when they turn up. So I just thought I would show you the decorations that were in my living room when I came downstairs this morning. My mum and dad got me some 18 balloons and then they actually made this like um, balloon arch, which is really cool. And then we've also got a banner. So this is actually like so cute. So I've just got back from having my lunch out and we've just been sitting having a chat with my grandparents. And I think in a minute we're going to have a little bit of cake when my little brother gets back. And then here we got a sneak peek of some of my presents, which you will see if you watch my what I got for my birthday video that I'm going to do. So I thought I'd show you guys my birthday cake. This is what it looks like. It is actually so cool with the little balloons and all of these toppings. So once Josh gets back from school, we are going to crack open the cake and start cutting slices. But I just thought I would show you it because it's so pretty. Okay, guys. So I just thought I would show you my outfit for going out as I'm about to leave. All my friends are about to come around. So I've got these trousers on, which are from Cider. And then I've got this top on that I showed you in a video the other day, which is from Urban Outfitters. So yeah, this is my outfit. And I might do some filming on my phone, but probably not. So if not, I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Oh, the music <laughs> hey guys, so it is now Wednesday. Um, I've been having just a really lazy day to be honest. I felt a little bit off this morning, um, <laughs> understandably. Um, and then I'm just having the rest of the day to chill. So ignore my hair. <laughs> I haven't even brushed it <laughs> but I thought I'd just come on and say I'm not sure how much of last night I didn't vlog anything so we, I might put some pictures in but I had such a good time me and my friends had a reservation at Slug and Lettuce for food um, and drinks <laughs> so we actually had it for 11 people but obviously the UK's rules you're only allowed six which is really annoying but luckily they were really accommodating and, um, and allowed us to sit like um, separate but close enough that we could still all talk to each other, which was really lovely. And then we went on to do another place called Fat Cats. Um, it was really busy in town, actually, because um, on my birthday, England were actually playing in the Euros, and they won. And obviously, every time England win a football match, everyone then decides that it's coming home. 
So Tam was absolutely rammed and um, I got sung happy birthday to by complete strangers and all sorts. So it was really fun. Um, and yeah, Fat Cats was almost like, kind of like a cross between a bar and a club. It had really loud music in. So it was all just dancing and singing like at our table. My voice is like suffering today. I feel like it's from Fat Cats because it was so noisy in there. That was my night. I actually got back around 12. So it wasn't as late as I thought, which is good because... I'm not I just can't hack a late night that I think that killed me more yeah I've got so many really amazing presents as well some of my friends have got me really cute things but for the rest of the day I'm just chilling on my bed um watching some Netflix in fact that's a lie I'm watching Amazon Prime I'm still watching Grey's Anatomy hey guys so it's now Thursday I actually went for an appointment this morning um for a consultation about getting laser hair removal sorry if this is something you're not interested in but i was really interested in getting it done on my arms so i went there this morning and i've actually booked like a few sessions so i'm really excited they start on saturday um so it's something i've wanted to do for quite a while i feel like it'll make my life 10 times easier so that is what i've done this morning but now i've just got back and done my makeup because i'm going to film my what i got for my birthday video so i haven't i didn't do one last year but i have done a few of these before and i just think it's something that'll be really cute because loads of my presents i got this year were quite sentimental and just really nice i think it'll be up by the time you're watching this vlog so i'll leave it linked up in the eye if you want to go and watch that but i'm just about to set the camera up and i'll show you the array of present bags i've got everywhere Okay, so we've got these two on the floor. Honestly, these are majoritively alcohol. And then here we've just got a pile of everything else. So I'm going to leave that video linked on this one. So you can go watch it if you want. But yeah, little sneak peek of what I got for my birthday. Hey guys, it's Izzy and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be filming something so exciting. And that is what I got for my 18th birthday. Hey guys, so it is now Friday and I thought I would update the vlog. Um, because let's just say plans have slightly changed. So I don't know if I mentioned it in the video, but Josh got sent home from school on Wednesday, I think it was, because someone in his class had got COVID. In the UK at the moment, we're kind of going through the third peak, but everything's still open, um, or there's not hundreds of restrictions in place. So Josh got sent home from school. However, he did actually test positive yesterday, along with my dad. So they both test positive on a lateral flow COVID test, which is obviously less accurate. So they actually went this morning, Friday morning, to go and get a PCR test. So we're still waiting the results of the PCR test. But obviously, whilst they've tested positive, we've all got to isolate for 10 days unless obviously the PCR comes back negative. All of my plans are now officially ruined. I did have a little cry about it yesterday because I would booked to go out tonight and tomorrow night. And obviously, I can't do that anymore. Yeah, obviously, it's a really annoying situation, but it can't be helped at you know whatsoever so yeah that is today i was supposed to be going to the chiropractor which is really looking forward to again uh, for my second appointment and then me and my friend were going out for drinks and then tomorrow it was supposed to be my first laser appointment um which again i was so excited for that and then i was going out for even more drinks with my friends so unfortunately it seems very likely that they've both actually got it and it wasn't a false positive, but we will have to see. This is probably going to be the end of the video because honestly, I have got to stay inside for the next 10 days, so I can't do anything. So I will definitely check in when I know if they're definitely positive or not. Um, and if they're not, then we will carry on with the video. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they are. Um, as they both have got some level of symptoms. Um, we did go to the cinema yesterday before I found this out and I watched In the Heights, um, the one that's kind of really musically and it was quite good actually. Um, not the hugest fan of musicals, but it was all right uh, for a musical. <laughs> that was yesterday, but today and for the foreseeable future, I'm trapped inside. Hey guys, so it's now the following week from when the majority of this vlog was filmed and I'm just editing this video and I never really updated you. So, <laughs> I got my PCR test back and mine was negative at the time I took it, but um, my mum has since tested positive as well. So it's obviously just going around our house at this point, but I just wanted to let you guys know that we're all okay um, and doing fine. So yeah, it's nothing really to be overly concerned about. Uh, so I just wanted to kind of add that into the video. I didn't want you to think that we were all like dying over here like we're fine um, but obviously it's just annoying with the isolation rules so with that being said this is definitely the end of this vlog i'm really sorry it's shorter than i thought it was going to be um i was really excited about the weekend plans as i'm sure i mentioned but unfortunately like obviously i can't leave the house so i couldn't do them i've got to isolate for quite a while now which is really annoying but hopefully it means i'm protecting everyone by staying inside for when i inevitably develop it as well um, I've got no symptoms or anything so far though, so I think I'm okay. But I did just want to say, 
over the next week or so probably for the next two weeks there won't be a weekly vlog because i haven't been filming it and there's no point me filming anything because the whole video would be in my bedroom i can't like it, it'd be so totally boring so i'm gonna take the next few weeks off of weekly vlogging once i'm allowed back out again i definitely will start doing it again don't expect any weekly vlogs but i am gonna try and stay on top of um that with the posts and stuff so anyway guys i really hope you did enjoy this video i know the start of this video is way better than the end but this is just sort of what happened this week so if you did enjoy this video make sure to like comment and also please subscribe and i'll see you guys all in the next one bye